over the last two weeks there has been a lot of talk about my backhook and how he has been handling uh, the situation at Columbus but we haven't really talked about Columbus new coach in Pascal Vincent and why Columbus fans should be really excited for this guy let's have a deep dive even though it, Pascal Vincent looks like he's like 35 he has actually been in the game for a long time he worked with likes of Jeff Carter Ryan Gretz, Gretzlap and Brent Seabrook as an U18 Canadian national uh, assistant manager and uh, the year after he actually worked with Sidney Crosby who's arguably one of the best Canadian players from 2000 until 2003 he had Matt Ander Fleury in his net when he was the general manager and the head coach for Cape Brenton Screaming Eagles after a few years in the juniors he finally got his big move in the 2011-2012 season he began his NHL journey with Winnipeg as an assistant coach he stayed at Winnipeg Jets until the 2016-2017 season and then he started to work at Manitoba Moose the AHL team and during his time there he worked with players like Jack Roslovic, Cal Connor, Andre Kopp and during his last season in Manitoba Moose he worked with prospects like Cole Perfetti, Ville Hinrola who has great future at uh, Winnipeg and then he also worked with Arthur Silos who became the turn player of the tournament at the 2023 World Championship when Kim Hitchnock and Dallas Stars parted ways in after 2017-2018 season Ian Montgomery got the job but Pascal Vincent actually was considered and like we know that like, considered doesn't mean a lot but he was still a candidate so Dallas Stars probably saw something in him that made, made him a good candidate but uh, they went with Jim in the end of the day in 2022 when Brad Larson and Steve McCarthy were in the protocol from 29th of March until 4th of April Pascal uh, were the coach for all three games we lost two against the Islanders and one against Boston arguably they were better, they were better than us anyway but if we check the score he actually did pretty well for himself I'm really excited to see what Pascal Vincent can bring to Columbus because if we just check like the uh, Travis City tournament for example even though we were like behind in that Detroit by like 4-1 we still managed to drag us back and like score 10 goals which is insane I know we conceded 7 but still and I rather watch that kind of hockey and lose than lose and win a game when we play boring hockey and for me I also think Pascal Vincent it seems like he knows how to bring out of the youngsters and we have a lot of them and uh, in his and this is like a paraphrasing now but he also said something like I don't care if they're AHLers or NHL or they're hockey players they they are gonna work hard and if they can't we're here to support them if they need some kind of help he's a really down-to-earth man and after like game 55 or something similar I wouldn't mind to have a beer or have a chili with him or something like that because he seems like that type of man and that is what I I have that's like my feeling of Pascal in general and I'm really really excited so what's your thoughts about Pascal and are you excited for this new season and can he change this team please comment down below and please like this video and have a great one good bye